Cub Scouts have it for Trustworthy, loyal, helpful, friendly, courteous, and kind, obedient, cheerful, thrifty, brave, clean, and reverent. These are a few of the scout laws that we try to follow in all of Cub Scouting. Hi, my name is Kelly Rogers. For four years now, I've been the Cub Master of Pack 761 North Fort Myers. I've always wondered from the day that I joined the pack, looking at all these old awards, looking at our pack trailer, looking at the prestigious names on all the derby races, how long has our pack actually been around? I know on the trailer it says doing our best for over 25 years, but it said that since I've been the Cub Master and it still says that now. I wanted to make a documentary, an interview of sorts, to go back, interview all of the previous Cub Masters who have made our pack what it is today, to find out their traditions, their legacies, preserve everything that they've tried to do to make Pack 761 the pack that it is today. So join me on this documentary as we find out the history of Pack 761. I guess our story starts here at beautiful Camp Miles. I had just finished my second weekend of Wood Badge, which has unfortunately paused for quite a while due to COVID. Ready to tackle my tickets. One of my tickets was this documentary. I didn't know quite where to start, but I was lucky enough to have some great names in scouting that used to be previous Cup Masters that are still heavily involved in scouting. They were able to offer some insight in who came before them and who took the reins up after them. But it still left me stuck a few times. I never really realized how long our pack has been around. The next stop after that is obviously the council office. Looking through old records and artifacts, any old news clippings I could find, talking to admin there, seeing if they could pull up any old records for me. Came to a lot of roadblocks with a lot of name changes. I looked through all of the plaques all the prestigious Eagle Awards, trying to find last names to, to possibly search. I spent many countless nights sitting down and searching the internet for anything I could find. Any key term at all that involved 761 and who has been Cub Masters. Reached out to other scouts, and scout leaders. Sometimes had good luck, sometimes I just didn't. But I kept on searching. Sometimes my searches would bring me to some pretty obscure things that I would find as far as scouting history. But ultimately, at the end of the day, I found enough footage, enough interviews to download some software to finally put this thing together. And surprising to me, what started out as just a mere history documentary ended up turning into something completely different. And the best word that I can think of to describe that is inspiration.